you pay 4,500 for a passport, and then you bribe 15,000 shillings to get the passport. So the bribe is higher than the passport. And then you're telling people they'll get jobs abroad. abroad. Fix the passport mess first at Nya House. And Uhuru, we applied for passports online in a cyber. And we only went there for a photo and the, 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 the biometrics, yes, the finger, yes. fingerprints. Mm -hmm. And we got our passports. When the CS for Interior himself declares Nyayo House a crime scene, who wants to waste their money? Nani ya kona 15,000 ya kubraibu watu wapatiwe passport. Now they've put such a big thing. They're advertising corruption. Go to Nyayo House. Outside there it's written, this is a corruption free zone. Something bigger than your mattress at home. Why have they found it necessary to do that now and it was not there before? It's because that place is a crime scene. And none other than the CS for Interior has declared it a crime scene. So don't tell us about jobs abroad if you can't give us passports. They are birthrights like IDs. We should get them if possible for free. I'm not saying we need them for free. But let it be possible for every Kenyan to get a passport before you can even talk about a nursing job abroad. Um, these MPs are not refusing.